Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and today we're doing something a little bit different. I'm going to Google myself, which I already know is a massive mistake. I actually thought of this because I was going to my YouTube channel, so I typed in call me Kevin and this happened. So check this out. You Google call me Kevin, you get musical artist and then you get links to songs that aren't even on my channel and then it's available on spotify and i think to myself i'm not on spotify did someone just start uploading my videos or something there so you click spotify and you go to call me kevin zero monthly listeners by the way and i appear on one song this one along with pixelated quantity cake jumper jacksepticeye and rt game and then you play it why? And well, I just wanted to dive deeper, so that's what we're gonna do. Oh, sorry, I already put on my headphones. Ah! Alright, let's get started again. There you can see my Spotify account. What is a Deezer account? What? That's not me. Is it? Maybe I am good at singing. All my life has been oh a my God, series he's so of good. I bet his parents him. love him. His RT game call me Kevin. <laughs> Often mistaken for being a different person, call me Kevin is actually RT game talking with himself for hours on end. Look, it's time to come clean. You are 100% correct. Now, let's never speak of this again. All right, let's be brave and look at my wiki. Oh, lovely picture. I really should think about growing back the mustache. I was just scrolling down, I realized it said height six foot one inch, which is actually correct. It's just there's so much misinformation regarding my height. Everything from just being an inch or two off to 4.7 inches tall, <laughs> which is somehow taken from the YouTube side. It's just Google picks that answer at all of them. And it's not true at all. It's inaccurate. The camera sometimes makes me look smaller than I am because the lens warps me. <laughs> Talking about my scar, he's also told various tales of how he got the scar, quipping that subscribers never got the same story and the truth would be open to interpretation. It's like it's the Joker or something. <laughs> no, and on a serious note, when I was about 14, I was in um, an elevator and I was trying to let someone in, so I went to stop the elevator and you know, usually go with your foot, but I was having a bit of a problem with my foot at the time. I sprained my ankle. So I went to catch it with my face and it just kind of pinched me there. Um, but that's how we got it. Very, very accurate so far. I'm pretty amazed by how accurate this, this all this information they've compiled is. Like it talks about how I moved to Scotland, uh, my, my school experience and leaving school, opening the store, restarting by my channel, the car accident, all, all this kind of thing. Everything is covered. I created Call Me Kevin clips. Look, I hate Call Me Kevin clips. The guy is always hating on me. Like, look at this. Yes, I'm still alive despite the numerous unbroken attacks from Call Me Kevin. Thank you for the sports despite all the drama. Like, I commented on it, hater, just because he is being a feckin' hater. But I just don't like him. Call Me Kevin dropkicks, baby. This is why we need to cancel the horrible YouTuber known as Call Me Kevin. You see, he's just lashing out. Like, me dropkicking that baby baby is entirely without context. It was a brat. It deserved it. <laughs> oh no, now he's gonna use that as fire against me as well. We need to cancel Call Me Kevin clips. Wait, look at this. Wait, what is this? Okay, so Kevin, summary, personal life, Sims 4 character. <laughs> and his Sims 4, but I abuse my magic. Kevin introduces subscribers to a character from the O'Reilly household. His first name does not appear in the video, however, appears on the gravestone in the video Sims 4, but I forced 24 Sims to live in a tiny home. As Kevin, he died almost immediately after being added to the Pickens household the day before death day when a mod caused him to be hit by a car. <laughs> it's just like, <laughs> Kevin O'Reilly. <laughs> Kevin O'Reilly, the little picture that stayed is dead. <laughs> I'm just gonna tweet that out with no context. <laughs> People are gonna think this is my account announcing my death and tweet. Why does this one just say yeah and a heart when all the rest are saying no? <laughs> that one person's like, yes, finally, the reason I follow it, the devil is dead. <laughs> <laughs> this reaction. I like that. Sorry to hear that, you king shit. More like Bor Ragnarok. This is the equivalent of faking your own death, going to your funeral to see everyone sad, and then they're all laughing at you. Oh, quotes. What funny quotes have I done? I fell into a burning ring of fire. I don't think I came up with that quote, to be fair. <laughs> Literally anything. More like Bor Ragnarok. That is everyone on my channel, not me. I'm more of a feck boy myself. Oh, no. Wait, what is this one? I never said that. The Asian guy is my favorite weapon. And I remember that video. Yeah, that was me. Why oh, should you eat special K? It's because they're delicious three grain flakes combined whole wheat barley. Why am I doing free advertisement for special K? Kevin's name in the Irish language is Quivine. Correct, correct. It is unknown whether Kevin can spell his name properly. Well, Wiki, 
Let me clear this up for you. Can't. <laughs> no idea how to spell my name in Irish. I'm assuming you're correct here, but I can't verify that information. It made tests awkward when I was in a child and, and we had to write our name in Irish at the top if it was an Irish exam. And I legit was like, this test is hard. <laughs> in September 2019, Kevin had a problem with butterflies interrupting his recordings. This is probably due to him being a Disney princess. I have suspected it. I need a timestamp here, people. Give me a timestamp. I can't find it. 541 for Kevin being a cute Disney princess. Ooh, ooh, that sounds nice. Oh, feckin' butterfly, will you get out of here? Oh, Why yeah. Come in? Disney princess. Get, in get out. That's Snow White for you. <laughs> At least my complexion would have you believe that. If Kevin was a girl, he'd go by the name Kavina? You've just decided this? What? What does this link to? Oh, yeah, of course. <laughs> I guess what Kavina would look like. Artist interpretation. Kevin knows seven Kavinas in real life. Yeah, that's true. That's a, co that's a common name. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> okay, can I just say... Bless whoever did the Jim Pickens family tree because they've done a page and it just keeps on going. <laughs> it's so long. Even the, the pictures <laughs> with me with the butterfly. This is so detailed. This is more detailed than me. Look at this. Oh my God. <laughs> Bless you for doing this. It's got all the different versions of Jim as well. It's like Minecraft, Vice City, which was just a terrifying reincarnation of Jim Pickens. He painted his cat pumpkin to say Jim's cat rather than purchase a name tag. <laughs> Wait, I'm on IMDB? Uh? Why do people always use this ancient photograph of me? It's so old. At least I have a good review, but I don't understand why I'm listed as a TV series. Wait, I, I have better reviews than Jack Spadicey. What the hell is this? This is obviously rigged. <laughs> Guys, can we freak it some more? Can you go like upvote me here? Or however IMDB works. Maybe I'll finally get a voice acting role. I'm sorry to bother you, but the town of Penis needs your help. Call me Kevin Carrack accident was a popular search. Real footage of Call Me Kevin getting hit by a car. This isn't real, just so you're aware. <laughs> like, I know you're not tricked by this, but just if someone immediately went to click off because they don't want to see violence. This is a lot of dislikes for some reason. Ah, uh, that's why. It was a hatchback that hit me, so that, that would be why. It's not lore friendly. And I didn't open fire on them, as far as I remember anyway. I'm going to tell it like this from now on, though. I'm just replacing my memory with that, because that was so much cooler by me. Is this real? <laughs> this is so sad. <laughs> the images, I see this. YouTube advertisement, car accident at the attorneys. Really, YouTube? You're going to do that to me? Kevin before the movie, Kevin after the movie. Oh, it's a good thing I'm not sensitive about it. Kevin going to the cinema to see Batman vs. Superman. Kevin leaving the cinema after watching Batman vs. Superman. It looks like I'm still smiling. I'm just like, oh, what a great movie. What happened to Call Me Kev? And it pops open. He died almost immediately after being added to the Pickens household. God, maybe lead with like in The Sims or something. The end of the last video flash help for a moment. Maybe he's been kept in pace and forced to make YouTube videos by a man who got hit him by a car and kidnapped him. No, I'm not kidnapped. I don't need help, okay? You can forget it with those questions. Wait, I'm an Urban Dictionary? Call me Kevin, the creator of Jim Pickens. This is what I'm going to be known for. No one will remember me. They're like, oh, good thing he brought us the cool person, Jim Pickens. Oh, no, wait, what? <laughs> I was reading them as I was going down. It's like, he's a fucking good YouTuber. He also is a fucking psychopath. But then it ends with, call me Kevin is shit. Why? But the rest is nice. Like, even the example, hey, have you checked out call me Kevin's YouTube channel? That's nice. Wait, what is this? Famous birthdays. Are you really stretching adding me into that mix. Sorry, sorry, I shouldn't be getting angry with you. You're Scorpio. <laughs> he and Zero Nine Shark Boy both create roleplay videos using various video games. Why is that associated with? Were you legitimately like the guy has no friends? Let's just throw a random person in here. But you know what? Despite all that, I'm glad to be associated with you. I would assume. I just assume they're a nice person. I'm 16th, born on November 10th. Who shares my birthday? Josh Peck. Wait, I'm... I, oh my god, I'm ahead of an actual celebrity. There's something wrong here. And ahead of Martin Luther, by the way. Take that, Martin Luther. I think mine should be religious leader as well. Can we get that changed? Call me Kevin is a member of Gaming Web Stars, 27-year-olds, YouTube stars, Scorpios, and that's just Joe Biden. <laughs> you know, I wonder after... All, I've Googled all of this and everything is just wrong. <laughs> Can we try to use Akinator and will it get it right? All right, so if you haven't seen this before, you got to think about a real or fictional character and you'll try and guess who it is. I am a character, I guess? I don't, I don't know. Is your character's gender female? No, but if it was, I'd be called Kavina. Is your character a YouTuber? On fourth question, you're already there. Does your character play Minecraft? <laughs> Oh, 
I guess? Is your character linked with the color green? I mean, I'm Irish, but I would say no. Does your character work for the CIA? They're on to us. I mean, no. Does your character use an indoor bathroom? No, I use a feckin' outhouse. What's that supposed to mean? It's really thinking. It's like, oh, that really narrows it down. Is your character obsessed with knives? What? Oh, no, I said no to being Mexican. Now it's going to look at my wiki and it's going to go, well, he wouldn't be dressed up like that. That would be cultural appropriation. So it can't be called me Kevin. I think I'm already gay. <laughs> Do you know what's hilarious about this? He played The Sims 4. What? Fuck. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Why does it guess him for me and me for him? Ah, oh, I told you we'd never speak of this again, and yet here we are. Is your character Irish? Okay, yes, we might be on the right trail here. Does your character have a uni bro? Oh. <laughs> no. Is your character associated with Call Me Kevin? Am I associated with myself? Yes. It's basically like, um, are you associated with Call Me Kevin? Yes. Is it? Call me Kevin. <laughs> it just wasn't confident enough to say it after the RT game fiasco. I'm just wondering, was it this the color green that threw it? I'm gonna say yes. Does your character play Quidditch? Like virtually, I guess? Is your character associated with a septic eye? Look, I don't wanna talk about it. It's a medical condition. Is your character a troublemaker? <laughs> a little bit. Yes, 25 questions. Okay, that's not bad. If I say yes, I'm associated with green. Even though I'm really not, I just happen to come from a country that is associated with green. But that gets me a lot quicker. And then you got stuff like Wattpad, which I am just not brave enough to do today. I think we're going to leave it there. Thank you so much for watching, folks, and learning so much about me. Some of it true, some of it false. But I hope you enjoy. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe if you're new, and I hope to see you tomorrow. Bye for now.